How's it going, guys? Um, my name is Tyler, and I'm going to go ahead and teach you all how to play the uh, little jazzy breakdown part in the song Sir Duke by Stevie Wonder. Um, just go ahead and get right into it. Um, so the song is in B major. So you're going to start off on the, the first note as a B. So, yeah, you know where a B is. Um, and then you're going to do a 2 6 4 on the A string. So very first part, easy enough. And then you're going to do a 4-6-4 four, four on the D string. So 2-2-6-4, two, 4-6-4. Two, four, four, four. So the whole thing. Okay, and then after that, you're going to do 4 on the D string, 2-4 on the E string, and 2 on the A string. So... So the whole thing so far is then you're going to do a 3 fret walk up on the A string and then you're going to do a uh, 2 fret kind of skip on the D string back to the 4th fret on the G string and then so after you play this on the D string you're going to go up to the 6th fret of the D string G string, I'm sorry, and do a 3 fret walk up. So, after is so the whole thing so far, I'll play it slow, is so we're already about a quarter of the way through it. So, um, after the uh, after the little 3 fret walk up, you're going to slide up to the 13th fret of the G string and you're going to play the 13th frets of the G and D strings then the 11th frets um, here's where it gets a little complicated everything up to this point is pretty easy you know not really doing a lot of uh, scales or strings, string skipping or anything um, that is all about to change um, you're going to start on the uh, 11th fret of the D string. I'll move in closer so you can see this. 11th fret of the D string, and what you're going to do is um, it's two frets on the D string, and then same root note, but three frets on the A and E strings. So, let's get back to the D string on the 11th fret. So, got that. Now, I got a little ahead of myself. Then, what you're going to do is you're going to stay in this note register, but you're going to move it to the G string on the 8th fret, um, just because you're going to do a whole walk down using all four strings. Now, this part is um, you're going to use the, um, for the first three strings, you're going to use the 6th fret as your root fret, right? Um, on the G string, you're using two frets. On the on the D and A strings, you're using three. And then on the E string, you're using two, but you're moving your root fret up to the seventh and not the sixth. So you're going to be using the notes. So those eight. Um, and what you're going to be doing is you're going to do a descending scale, um, and you're going to do kind of note skipping. So you're going to go... And then the note before that, note before that, so that's the idea of it. The, the way it's played is, then you go down to the 4th fret and the 2nd fret of the E string. So, so this whole part is, sorry. And then after the, uh, you're going to go, so four, two, four, two, four, six, four, six, four, two, four, two, four, six, four, six, four. So the whole thing so far is... And then I go ahead 
killing myself. And then, uh, 646, 646, 646. But you're gonna skip strings, so. So G string, D string, D string. G string, D string, D string. Du, 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 du. And then two F sharps. So the whole thing, so, f or the whole thing, rather, not so far is. And I'm not gonna play it up to speed at all. I'm just gonna play it so you guys can slower, so you guys can follow along with it. Eventually, you can get it up to the speed of the song. Um, so the whole thing. I'm gonna play this right here. We go. Um, as far as that F sharp goes, some people like playing the high F sharp. Um, I personally like doing the the low one because this is a bass guitar, and so you're gonna hold the hold the bass bottom end down. So um, I hope this helped. Um, I know that I, you know, kind of messed up, and this is kind of long, but um, the way I learned it is in sections, um, and so that's how I taught it. Um, I just learned this tonight, so don't give me a bunch of you know, crap, oh, you played it wrong, and all that crap, so, um, yeah, once again, I hope this helps, and, um, thanks for watching.